What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're in the capital city of Albania and we're going to take you on a food tour around some of the best restaurants here in Tirana. Let's go! The first restaurant on our list today is going to be Oda, O-D-A, and they're supposed to have traditional Albanian cuisine. I can't wait! For this restaurant choice today, we're going to be going based off of Google reviews. This place here had a lot of positive Google reviews. So like many other things, such as medical advice, we're placing our trust in a random search engine. Here at Oda, we are going to order uh, a rice soup, Supe Perime de Oris, it's called, I think. Um, we're going to order some lacor, maybe with some leek or spinach. Let's see what they have to offer here and what they have in stock already prepared. And some tavedu, which is kind of like a terracotta type of dish um, with cottage cheese, some liver usually, like and some sort of cheeses in there. It's really, really tasty. It doesn't sound as tasty when I describe it, but it's very tasty, let me tell you. If you do come to Albania, you have to try a tavedu. So guys, check this out. They have a bunch of raki options here. Muscat Oda, they have their own one, the Oda grape. Uh, plum, raki, mulberry, blackberry, cardinal. So there's a whole bunch of options here to try. I don't think we're gonna have raki at the very first place because it is only midday. So it's around one o'clock right now. So I don't think we're gonna be having a raki. Um, we'll wait until like later on in the day maybe. Uh, this is actually something we tried the last time that we were here. We were in Bobo Stitza and we tried some dal uh, or dala. I'm not too sure how to say that properly. And that was absolutely delicious as well. Um, something that goes really, really well with La Croix actually. So we decided to sit outside because inside there's copyright issues. We're YouTubers, I know it's complicated. So we're sitting outside and they decided to turn on a heater. Check it out, bam. So it's actually pretty cozy here. And it's really interesting if you come with me for a second. There's a map here that people keep stopping and taking pictures of. So help us out in the comments, guys. It's kind of broken down uh, into a couple of different things i know this here is serbia i know the adriatic gora um if you can help us out with that probably some type of sea uh bulgaria albanski albani albana and then we have greece ekia and yon so let us know in the comments guys what is this breaking down here first up is the rice soup let's give it a try Mm. Wow. I mean, so tasty. Nice hearty soup. <laughs> wow. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Perfect for the weather as well. We got a nice basket full of fresh bread here too. This is going to be really tasty to go with this soup too. I'm going to eat the entire soup. Luke is not going to get anything. <laughs> So I'm gonna go straight in guys with a piece of bread. Nice hearty way to start the day and to start this food tour guys. Gonna go nice big dip. So this soup seems to be somewhat of a mixture of rice, um, some parsley, carrot, everything that you need to warm your soul on a cold day here in the Balkans. Cheers guys, Gizwar. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. that's beautiful really tasty it's already warming me up as well so i can't wait to dig into the rest of this amazing soup the bread as well is so thick and fluffy and airy and it's everything you can ask for especially for the beginning of a meal. I can't wait to see the rest of the dishes as well. Oh, wow, guys. So we just got the lacroix. This is something that we have missed so much since we left Albania and we started traveling elsewhere. Lacroix, kind of like a pie, traditional Albanian style pie. We got it with a leek. 
we asked for the spinach but they didn't have the spinach but leek is probably going to be just as good if not better oh uh -huh. the pull apart yeah look at the steam coming off of that liqueur yes yeah yes. don't mind me guys if you hear me eating i'm just here dipping my bread and enjoying my soup Naomi, first try of the leek liqueur. Leek liqueur. Okay, I'm gonna do it with my hands. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. This is so good, you guys. Oh my god. You can tell just by looking at it, the quality of the ingredients that goes into this, the steam coming off of it. Everything is just high quality and super comfort food. I think I have a new type of, new favorite type of liqueur. <laughs> Before, my favorite was always the tomato and onion pie, but the leek, wow. Life changing. So good, you have to try it. Yeah, big bite. Fork, knife. Utensils at the ready. I'm gonna go in for this leak. Let's see what it's like. Let's see if I approve. We've had our fair share of liqueur the last time we came to Albania. We had it in Korcha, we had some in Babushditsa, and every time we've been pleasantly surprised. So, guys, first time trying a leak liqueur. Wow, okay. Even better than I expected. It's really, really fresh. As I said before, the steam coming off of this, it just warms you up instantly. And the taste is unmatched to anything else that we've tried so far. So guys, if you can't tell already, we've polished everything off. We're really hungry. And that food was some of the best food that we've ever had actually. So now we're just waiting for the final dish, the Tavi Du. Beautiful. So just as I recorded that last clip, it came out. This is the Tavi Du. I hope I'm saying that right guys, but it's basically like a very beefy terracotta style cheesy dish again probably an in well one of the most sort of soul food if you will of albania this is something that's really just going to heat you up on a cold winter day and set you right we after this are heading to two more places so keep watching because we have a day full of carnage ahead of us guys lots of food lots of calories lots of fun Ooh. Food. Going in for the first piece of meat. I think it's liver. I hope it's liver. Let's give it a try. Very hot. I'm gonna burn my mouth. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh yeah. It's liver. <laughs> <laughs> Super tasty. I always feel like the cottage cheese in the Tave Deux, it always tastes a little bit like it's fermented. At, at least according to my taste buds, obviously, I don't know if it's the truth, um, but it's super tasty. If you have a look at the, the cottage cheese here with a little bit of the peppers in that, in that broth. Hot. It's really hot. <laughs> <laughs> so hot. So tasty. <laughs> okay guys, so a little bit of a taste test here. I'm going in with my fork to try and get a piece of this meat out. It just keeps spinning on me, but I got one. Very excited to try this. 
this is a dish look at the steam coming off of it guys wow um this is the dish that we've had quite a few times now um the last time we were in albania this was actually one of our go-to dishes and something that we always tried in every place that we went there's actually a place not too far from here that we might go to in this video who knows but it's one of our favorite spots in tirana for this particular dish so guys here we go mm. yes okay that's incredible the texture of the meat is juicy it's not dry at all really warm like i said comfort food at its finest all right guys so the meal is finished um to be honest we didn't have that much food but we're really full because of how hearty and just well prepared that food was so what was your favorite my favorite dish was definitely uh the rice soup followed by the tavedu and the lacour i said i i i <laughs> I think in a shared second place. So the soup for me was number one, but I'm a soup type of person. So. Oh, okay, guys. So for me, um, I'm going to go ahead and pick the La Croix as being number one for me. That was absolutely amazing. Probably some of the best La Croix that we've ever tried. Um, so definitely, if you're looking for a nice La Croix pie and you're in Tirana, check out Oda. Um, second for me would be the soup believe it or not um, i'm typically not a soup person or a soup guy but that soup was incredible um really tasty and it went really red really went really well with the bread as you can see completely empty bread basket so that was really good tavidu was number three still an unbelievably tasty uh meal liver cheese everything you can ask for in one little heated dish and we did finish it off check it out that entire meal came to a total of 1390 lek so i think it's around 11 euro and 50 cents or something like that we are so full but there's no stopping us today so let's go to the next restaurant So guys, right now we're just actually outside Bunkart, which is something uh, we were told is a must-see when you come to Tirana. This is our second time here and we actually still haven't been, so it's definitely on our list, maybe in the next video, so stay tuned for that. So guys, next up we're going to be taking a recommendation straight from the comment section from one of our subscribers. We're going to head to a place called Capital, which is on Ruga Cavayas. So very excited to check this out i believe it's going to be like some dirham and donor and stuff like that so let's go check it out so guys you might be asking yourself the question why come to capital well the answer is just inside this menu because it's helpful it's respectful it's always fresh and it's hygienic very good very nice very good very nice Look at my fries. <laughs> oh, wait. I have a small fork. <laughs> That's the perfect, the perfect fast food option here. Very good. The meat is super juicy, really fresh vegetables, and you get some fries as well in the durum itself. 
so it's just perfect and you get a little bit of tzatziki with it amazing so guys i went with the pita pula which seems to be somewhat of a donor meat chicken donor i'm guessing on nicely toasted pita bread a little bit of mayo some cheese is in there as well and I also got a cup of tzatziki. <laughs> this dude has Adolf Hitler as his screensaver. Where are you from? Uh, Ireland. Ireland. Ireland and Germany. Uh, I hope you wear a German. <laughs> I am German. German. <laughs> oh, sorry. It's okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Babshim. <laughs> the guy was... <laughs> yes, yeah, yeah. I want to see. It's called uh, Nalu Adventures. What? Nalu Adventures. Right. Yeah, I can write it for you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I noticed that you wear four games and I said I have to do this. Nalu <laughs> Adventures. Subscribe. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. I will wait to see. Cheers. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> New subscriber. Uh, Hitler fan. <laughs> That was the most random interaction ever, guys. He was sitting inside the window here of Capitol, and I saw his screensaver, and I was like, oh, this is weird. I don't know what's gonna happen here. And then he started showing his phone out the window, really excited, so yeah. Don't know what way to react to that. I don't know if he's doing that just as a joke or whatever, but yeah. Uh, back to the pita sandwich. Um, nice meat, nice cheese, nice bit of sauce. Cheers, guys. Oh yeah, that's delicious. Again, the common theme here with Albanian places and food places around Albania is it's cozy comfort food and it really warms you up and um, it's perfect. This place here is really cheap and it's really central so definitely check capital out when you're in Tirana. That food was delicious and definitely a great recommendation from one of our subscribers there in the comments. Thank you very much for that recommendation. 810 lek was how much the food came to, which is six euro and 50 cents roughly. So last stop now, guys, we are headed to a bakery. We need something sweet. So we're at Lebon, Tirana. we decided to get the Limoni <laughs> cake and the Ferrero cake as well. Um, both of them together just came to 3 euro which was like 370 lek roughly. Mm -hmm. 380 lek. 380 lek so very cheap um, and incredible quality pastries really filling and rich um my personal favorite was the limoni and i think it was yours as well my personal favorite was the limoni as well and we do have to mention it for 380 legs you get patisserie style cakes like 
you would get them in like France and Paris for 50 euro a piece I'd say yeah and that they're genuinely the same quality and they taste the same as if you would be in Paris somewhere in a very fancy bakery but you're in a fancy bakery in Tirana and you're saving a lot of money which is absolutely amazing yeah for sure and this place Le Bon is really cool very kind of fancy looking but it's right here in the center of Tirana they do coffee and they do real food as well like pasta and chicken and seem to do like roast dinners as well so Definitely put this Le Bon Tirana on your list when you're coming here. It's amazing. It's bon. So guys, this was our Tirana food tour around the capital city here of Albania. I hope you guys enjoyed it. My name is Luke. My name is Naomi. And we are Nalu Adventures. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.